Hello everyone, I'm Miss Wonderland and you look beautiful today. Welcome back to the Crooked Man. You graduated but you're still studying? Hey, lay off. Yeah, I couldn't pass the bar exam. So I'm cramming at home now. Next up's gonna be my sixth attempt. There were lots of great guys in my class, most of them passed it in one shot. Being a lawyer has been my dream since I was a kid, so I was so happy when I got accepted here. Felt I was one step closer to making it come true. The work was rough, and I just barely managed to graduate. I think it's my kind, helpful professors that did it. I'll pass. I will pass next time for sure. I mean, it's my sixth time. Any more and I will be way behind my classmates. Well, it's good to be motivated. Yep. But it's dangerous here. You should get out of here soon. Huh? Dangerous? What? Uh, it's sort of hard to explain. <laughs> There's kind of a, well, monster in here. <laughs> it will attack you if you if it finds you. Just saying. I thought you were just some weird old guy wandering in an abandoned school, but damn, you are really nuts, huh? Seriously, a monster? Even little girls don't believe that stuff. You're being a little doofus. Do you enjoy making fun of people? And I don't think I'm much older than... <coughs> don't square with me, alright? I'm a talented, soon-to-be lawyer. You'd be no match for me. Um... Yeah... Do what you want, but don't say I didn't warn you. Yeah, I will do what I like, thanks. Like I need a shady punk like you telling me what to do around my alma mater. <laughs> Excuse me, princess. Hey, Paul. I, I got in. What? Really? You got in to flight school. It's crazy, David. I can't even do a handstand. You can do whatever you put your mind to. <laughs> Thanks. But it doesn't make me a pilot yet. Still have to pass the exam. Man, dude, you totally will be. And make sure to give me a ride. I love to fly above a city sometime. Paul, I'm not going to fly passenger planes. It's not that kind of school. Don't sweat the details. I'm glad for you. You did good. Hey, I'll take you to lunch today. Yeah, free food. Back then, I wasn't really thinking. I was just going wherever I wanted. I wonder if D is like that. Ah, oh, David, 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 David. You have a very complicated life. The Julius Stone School newspaper is posted up. Julian Stone. Is this the code 619? Live <laughs> place blah blah blah. I don't know. The room matches the other pages, so he was here. Many hopes were fulfilled here, many youngs were blessed, but I didn't receive that blessing. What's so bad about me? I was never picked by anyone. 
It never made sense. I loathe those days. He had a leaf. He had a leaflet for the school. It was in the desk. Felt like it was important. Was he trying to be a lawyer like he was? I guess this would imply he didn't become one. Hmm, that's sad. That's a big room. It screams like the crooked man will come here. There's nothing to it? Really? Nothing that screams like a crooked man fight. Oh, don't, 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 don't. Oh, thank you. Where am I going then? What am I doing? I don't think I need a screwdriver anymore, so... Why not, I guess. <sighs> I'm so lost again. So there were the numbers six nineteen. Yeah. Oh, key to the lecture rooms. I knew there was something I lacked, but I didn't want to admit it. My ambitious youngfulness wouldn't let me. I wanted someone to say it. I wanted to be woken up, to be told I am a uh, half not leaking. I have not. It's true. There are haves and have nots. People whose dreams can come true and... Aww. Again. Sometimes my head just starts hurting bad. Drink something, eat more. <gasps> Shake it off time. D d damn monster, why are you chasing me? <laughs> Am I dead? Am I dead? Oh good. <laughs> you didn't kill me, why? I'm I'm alive. The monster's gone. I thought it would kill me, but it left. Damn it! Ah, oh, my neck hurts, and I feel so. Oh, your neck hurts! Don't do that. I haven't really slept since yesterday. I should try to rest somewhere. I know where. Oh my God! You're so slow. Nine twenty one in the autorium crime among the thing. Aha. All right, let's try to rest because he's so slow now. I'm so slow now. <laughs> yeah. Wrong door. But it's okay. Take your time. Go to bed. I take a little nap. Pushing myself wouldn't be a good idea. Good night, David. No, oh, I feel a lot better. All right, let's go. Yeah, I'm quick again. Why did you do that? Nothing happened. That was weird.
don't trusting this game. Nothing. Oh, what am I doing now? I already know that. Ooh! Criminal behavior. That notice in the lecture room mentioned this. I don't understand a word of it. Hmm. There's a slip of paper in here. What's the number? 99814. I know it. You don't. Yeah. David, David, David. Yeah, 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 yeah. The question is where's the room? I think upstairs. <laughs> I'm getting lost so easily. Never leave me somewhere in the woods or something like that. I would die immediately. Hi. Nine nine eight one. I contain the key to the computer room. Alrighty then. Save. I'm not leaving a roof anymore without saving. Computer room, where were you? I don't know. I don't know. I'm so confused again. Yeah. Hi. Lots of complicated papers. I don't understand any of them. 1709. Andrew. Andrew. Or the ID. Something is important here. I don't know what, but something is. Laptop computer has no power. Doesn't have power. Doesn't have power. Do I need to go in the basement? I don't want to go in the basement. Hmm. Alright. What? It has no power. <coughs> <coughs> Friends, factory and stuff. I uh, thank you for coming today. We're glad to have our sunny graduation to start off the rest of our lives. The future may be uncertain for some, but the persistence we learned here will make us resolute. Resolute. A round of applause for my fellow graduators. What? The laptop? But there's no power. Yeah, that's what I said. But even as valedictorian, there's something I can't help but limit. It's about David Hoover. <gasps> he was highly skilled, kind to all of us, kind to us all, and admired by pills and t-shirts alike. We all ex we all expected he would be proudly standing with us this morning to graduate. But our hopes were dashed. By none other than the man himself. Hiding behind an innocent face, he's been fooling all his pup pupils and professors. Let me ask you all this. Would he be forgiven? Can he escape punishment for betraying his friends and mentors? 
I didn't think so. He should forever be punished for what he has done to grant his selfish dreams. What's going on? Stop it! Stop! You're the lowest of low. Your dreams will never come true. What are you even good for? <laughs> Go off and die somewhere, coward. Oh, that's so horrible. It's totally not funny. Can I move? What am I doing? Stop! Oh, wow, David. Alright, everyone. I will see you all in the next part. Take care of yourself. Bye-bye.